Hey guys, welcome back. Um, once you click your patient and you've done a PE study, click the thins and then load it to... Once you click a patient from here, it's gonna show the thins. So the ones with the most images, it's gonna be your thins. It'll come up for a PE study. So this is just a testing. And then you're gonna to go to your top left-hand corner and load it to... CT viewer. CT viewer. And then this is going to pop up. So once this pops up, the first thing you want to do is make your patient face you in a coronal view. So this is supposed to be a corona view. And after that, you're going to click here, this chevron button, and come down to batch. And then once you're there, you're going to click your preset to your left pulmonary and then once you click that this is going to pop up and then you're going to left click right here and that's going to help you scroll so once you scroll and you find your pulmonary there well in this case it's going to be your left side you're going to want that elongated and once you get that through um, you can adjust it to get your left pulmonary elongated with this button over here and just make sure you get all your lung fields and then kind of scroll through it to make sure everything's nice and once it's nice you're going to click this to save it and then you're going to label it left pulmonary or whatever you have to label it and then save it so that would be your left side and then after that, you would do the same thing, but for your right side. And again, you would strain it up, make sure you go through it. And if it's not straight enough, then you can rotate it so that it matches the right pulmonary. And this is gonna help you look through the pulmonary. Just make sure it's nice and elongated. And then you're gonna save it again. Click this, label it and save it. After that, you need your rotation. So you're going to click rotation and then this part, rotational MIP, and that this corner over here is going to change. Wait, you have to click this first. So you're going to come down here and it has to be your Y axis. changing it no mm, rotation there it is so chrono click this rotational MIP this is gonna be why you know wait for that to come through and then that's pretty much it for the rotational and then save it and it's gonna be your rotational MIP. Save and that's it. Then send everything else. And that's how you do a CT pulmonary reconstruction after you scanned it. So I hope that helps. Toodles noodles. And don't forget to follow me on my regular YouTube channel called Kamani on Earth. And I'm also on Instagram, Kamani.d12. Okay, bye!